Good morning. Do that information what you will. Good morning. Hello. Why are your freckles white? It's an aesthetic. Do you get like a crayon and just dot it? Actually, your face? I got a marker. Um, thank you very much. Uh, but they do make like makeup pencils that are that you can do that with technically. So why would you want artificial? What the fuck? <laughs> no. Some so people cringe. get some people get freckles tattooed on. That's so cringe. Oh my god. Or they do like henna, like henna dyeing, so it has temporary tattoos. What are you looking at? The sky. Yeah, you're right. It's day. I can't exactly see the sun from this angle, so I'm gonna guess it's above us. Yeah, what's yeah. means? No, it's out of. It's either out to the east or out to the west. Well, it's to the east. It is going down right now. I think. No. East is up. Yeah, sun rises in the east, sets in the west. Okay, well that direction is the east, and it's definitely going down. Oh, wait. Yeah. Oh, that's not good. Wait. Never mind. There it goes. It's going up. I think it was I frozen, it so up. I was- I think it was frozen, so it was tripping balls, but now it's actually moving. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Where's Cat? Oh yeah, where is Cat? Probably busy. We should let her be busy. Are you busy causing hijinks across the city? Yeah. Oh, she's oh. wreaking havoc. <laughs> oh God. How do we take this these moments to ourselves? You know, for ourselves. Hey, Braylon. <laughs> What's up? The front doors of the town hall would once again be open as Braylon would be looking through a large stack of letters. Oh dear. Oh dear. Good morning. Ah, uh, good morning, heroes. I hope you slept well after last night's antics. Yeah, well, well enough. What's up with the papers? Merely one of those letters I told you about. It seems that Etheria is not the only kingdom suffering from such celestial monstrosities. This has become quite the unfortunate misfortune upon our realm. He sighs. It seems like it's one thing after another in the Aether, doesn't it? We've been no stranger to a bit of bad luck here and there, but usurpers and celestial creatures in the same year are unheard of. Yeah, honestly, uh, you guys have really have been suffering with a lot. He sets the papers down on his desk, taking a step forward toward the front of the, the front windows. Still, as we have through the centuries, we will learn to adapt. Yes, after all, it's not the first time angels have been threatened, and it certainly will not be the last. Right. <clears throat> Anyhow, he turns back toward all of you. I suppose you have a busy day ahead of you, right? You have to find yourselves a willing airship to take you across the Aetherian provinces, after all. We can't keep Aelin's quest waiting. If she truly believes that you heroes will be the ones to save our realm once more, I think I speak for everyone when I say that I would like such salvation to arrive quickly. <laughs> Oh yeah, of course. Uh, we'll do our best, okay? I hope I'm not pressuring you all too much. I'm sure you'll do perfectly fine. Look, uh, look how do we get an airship? Oh, you're in luck, actually. A theory's economic resurgence has caused several merchants from other provinces to visit. And the docks are as busy as ever, with ships going in and out to drop off of supplies or valuables. I'm certain there will be someone on the docks that's willing to give you a ride back to their original provinces. Uh, speaking of these provinces, uh, we don't know much about them, so can we know more about them by any chance? Oh, of course! Uh, as you can see on this map, the Aetherian provinces are divided into different sectors, with the Kingdom of Aetheria being in the center of it all. In every cardinal direction, you have one of the four provinces that surround the kingdom. The provinces of Arcadia, Elysium, Avalon, and Rapture. Ah, it's like Hyrule! Uh, I'm I'm sorry. What exactly is Hyrule? I ignore her. She's an idiot. All right then. Anyhow, between each of these regions are a ton of villages, town or tons of villages, towns, cities, and empty skies, which is what makes the provinces so difficult to traverse if you do not have an airship at your disposal. Yeah. Um. Actually, have you heard of the legend Aelin told us about? It's like something about some ultimate trial. The server hasn't. <laughs> of course. It's a rather common legend, actually. 
The legend that the goddess will bestow a great trial to a select few of whom she deems worthy. And upon that trial's completion, she will personally title them the Heroes of the Winds. Or something like that. Yeah, well, it sounds pretty far-fetched to me. Well, given the current circumstances of the kingdom, I think we could all use a far-fetched legend, hmm? It, you know, fair enough. I won't keep you any further then, heroes. Good luck locating an airship for yourselves. And don't be shy to interact with some of the merchants in town. I heard that some of them may come from the very provinces you'll be wanting to visit. It's never a bad idea to get more information on where you'll be going. Good to know. Yeah, you're right. Um, yeah, thanks, Braylon. Huh. Hmm. It hmm. would be good to get some insight. Or we get an airship and, you know, not give a shit. And this chick is still just unconscious out of it. Just... God. I I'm sensing a kidder beans. <laughs> uh, uh -oh. <laughs> Why am I laughing? Does she up? realize that she's invisible? Yeah, I, I don't know. Maybe that's I'm the point. Fishing for idiots. <laughs> <laughs> they did a pretty bad job the first few times. Give me my gauntlet back. Do I have to? Yeah, and also rematerialize. Oh, what the hell? What? You look what? chipper. <laughs> oh. So, someone's really happy. Okay. Alright, well, since you're in such a great mood, give me my damn gauntlet back. Where yeah. did you find that? I don't remember. You stop. Did, did she see? Oh god. No, Definitely. why would I do that? I, mean, I don't need it right now. She could just keep it for a time being. Come on. Let's go look at the docks and figure out which ship we want to use. Maybe a big one? A lot of library would be nice. Have a spell in it. Yeah, I don't Aim. keep them strapped to the. Maybe we could talk to Ash Ketchum. Well, excuse me? What? Drew, no. <laughs> Come on! Some of the rest of us need to drop off crates and materials too! Move your damn boat already, you pirates! An unfamiliar angel in some sort of uniform would be shouting at the ship of the idealist in anger. You don't even have a permit to park here! Do you think the rest of us wouldn't have to lug all these boxes of resources from our boat all the way here? Sooner, we'd sooner fall out of the sky completely! Uh, hey, uh... Are you one of the merchants coming to Etheria? Eh, what's it to you? They turn in your direction and look you up and down. Oh, I get it. You're one of those heroes I've heard about. The angel and the groundlings that saved the king or something. Listen, kids, if you're looking for some kind of refund... Actually, um, is it maybe possible if we can go with you back to your prov province? Eh? He stares at you for a bit. Before laughing slightly. <laughs> yeah, sorry kids, we don't take stowaways, especially ones that forward with their demands. If you want to ride back, it's gonna cost you. We're not just some free transport vessel, we're a cargo ship for Avalon. L listen, we'll do our best to pay, but what we have to- We just, honestly, just need a way to Avalon. Dang, huh? I bet heroes like you probably have some deep pockets. Alright, fine. How's 125 Ethereum sound, big shots? 125 Ethereum! Too much, huh? Then move along, maintain passengers without proper compensation. Fine, asshole. <sighs> Whatever, I'm sure his ship looks stupid anyway. And Marcy's just doing the same thing Cat she did yesterday. Cat, Cat, no. Cat! Cat, yes. Where did you go? Cat, no! <sighs> Man! Cat, where's my gauntlet? Shut oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, that's no dialogue hours. there. Man! Keep looking around. This thing's broken. I Good. just don't know how to use it right. 
Which is fitting because you just stole it, so obviously wouldn't know how to- Who's this guy? Hans. Oh, Hans. Hello. Angel stands at the other end of the docks with their hands on their hips. Looking like another clear day? Oh, the big factory ship is done getting their materials soon. We have our own stuff to get onto the docks for the manifesto. Uh, hey, uh, excuse me? The server will not excuse you. <laughs> oh! Oh, there. I think I recognize you guys. You're the heroes of Aetheria, right? Uh, uh, stop. Uh oh. Curf- oh, no, curfew. Uh, uh oh. Uh, house, oh. house, house. Yeah, let's move. <laughs> Scatter. Let's get back to the town hall, just like quickly or something. Oh yeah. Start sprinting. We're in the middle of a conversation, man. Suck it up, Marshy. <laughs> the other people are kind of beating it too, you know? Yeah. Oh there. Careful, I don't see anything. We get moving. Go, go, go. Okay, I'm in. Go. I'm in. Shit! You good? Cat just tried to block you out. <laughs> oh my god, cat! God damn it. Oh, there it is. Oh, what the hell? It! What the hell are these things? Where the hell did they come from? I don't know, that's kind of fun. Those things are fucking terrifying. Look, guys, come on. Let's go upstairs. Yeah. Remember, we have beds, yeah? Yeah, we can. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just see if we can get the night to pass. Yeah, I'll take this one. That was mine. Okay, whatever. Well, <laughs> thank you, Cooper Beats. <laughs> okay, now let me know this. Go on, we gotta hurry. A cat blocked us in. Cat. <laughs> Cat, give it. me my hat back. Give it back. No. Cat. Put these back where you got them. Give it back. I can't carry that many things. <laughs> yeah, give me back my hat and you can carry those things, okay? Then drop my gauntlet. And my hat. No. Please. Cat, we don't have all day. Please. Come on, look, it's fine. Yeah, let's let's not back. waste this day, okay, guys? Yeah, we can't really afford to just waste time, then. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, we just need to keep an eye out on time. Okay, It'd be I'll nice if we could have a clock with us. Maybe that's an investment we I can mean, make. I guess the sun is our clock at the moment. Tick. Yeah, well, Tick. seeing one in my hand Tick. would be better than having to look Tick. up all the time. Yeah. yeah. Tick. Okay, let's stop the Hans. Yeah, okay. thank Tick. you, cat. <laughs> yeah! The angel stands at the other end of the docks with their hands on their hips. Looking like another clear day. Uh, the big factory ship is done getting their materials soon. We have our own stuff to get onto the docks for the manifesto. Uh, hey, uh, excuse me? Oh! Hello there. I think I recognize you guys. You're the heroes of Aetheria, right? Great to meet you. Thanks for your service in saving our king and everything from those angels that would have replaced him. I mean, the entirety of the Aetherian provinces owes you big time. Yeah, 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 yeah whatever. Where, where do you come from? Uh, me? I'm just one of the riggers for the Arcadian Trading Shit Company. Our ship is just out there, waiting for a chance to dock and drop off our supplies. Um, could you possibly take us with you when you leave? Take you with us? Back to Arcadia? I don't know, heroes. I mean, don't get me wrong, we owe you a lot for saving King Seraf, but... It's not exactly company policy to take passengers. After all, our ship is a trading ship, not a transport ship. Okay, well, do you know when a transport ship will be arriving, then? Actually, I think there's a transport ship in town somewhere. Uh, yeah, right up there. The angel points to the top of the docks, where Captain of some kind seems to be speaking with Fleece, the irritable Valkyrie. I think that right there is Captain Cavriel, the Aetherian province transportation. You should talk to him for a ride if you need to get to a different province, alright? Oh my god, thanks for your help. We greatly appreciate it. The server doesn't. <laughs> Server does not appreciate Server it. Server denies. No problem. Hey, hey, if you have the chance, you should check out the Arcadia Saw in the indoor market near the town hall. You wouldn't want to miss some of the items we have for sale from our province. Good day to all of you. Yeah, yeah, sure. Uh huh. Well, whatever. Let's go. Let's not waste our time more than we have to. Cat with a hat. Cat with ships. a hat. That's the factory ship. Cat with and a is hat. it the what one out in the air? Crime. Yeah. Could be, yeah. 
All right, come on, idiots. Uh, Reed's up here if we want to talk to Reed on the way. Oh my it is, goodness. Wait, wasn't Reed over here yesterday? No. I uh, don't- No, Reed was in- Reed was somewhere else. Oh. Huh. Hello. Adam! Goodness gracious, now where did you go? Uh oh. Oh no. Uh, that sounds like trouble. Anyway. Not our trouble. So are they up here? Aha, oh yeah, I see there they are. Fleeky. Hello. The Valkyrie is speaking with Captain Gavriel, attempting to barter. Right. The captain speaks with Fleece carefully. I'm not so certain, my dear Valkyrie. Before I make any decision with you, I'd love to hear from your captain. I'm okay, afraid Marcia, Kale wanna... is quite busy right now, but I can pass along your answer, of course. I know how it sounds, I'm... but I'm just telling you what I know. If the Valkyrie could get some form of discount on your transport, or your company will be paid off, paid back for the difficulties of having to add a new, uh, new, adding the new pantheons on your routes. You okay there, Marshy? I can't Marcia, read. Do I need to take over? I mean, you uh, can't barely read either. <laughs> yeah. Just get good. Or I'll execute sometimes, you. Sometimes, it's very rare that I actually can read, but sometimes <laughs> I can. <laughs> it's more jarring when you can't read. Sometimes you can actually do it decently, but like here you're just like, I'm afraid Kill okay. is quite I don't, busy so right Ner now, now. Uh, but say your I, line! I can't, can! <laughs> okay! Um, excuse me, um, uh, Gabriel, right? Hmm? The captain and Valkyrie turn you quickly. Whoa, whoa! If it isn't the heroes of Aetheria, pleasure to make your acquaintances official, finally. Yes, I am Captain Gavriel of the Province Transportation Company. How can I help you? Uh, can you take us through the Aetherian provinces? Naturally! My company offers the fastest method of transportation across the provinces, with your own customizable experience. We offer first-class passage to the skies of the Aether, meals cooked directly on board, and even a bar and recreation facility aboard our ship. Are you interested in booking a flight to another province, Heroes? Yeah, we, we need to get to another province. Well, that won't be a problem with my company. If you'd like to simply wait here, I can go back to my cabin and pick up the proper tickets after you each give me a small payment of- Wait, hey, 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 wait, 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 payment? Uh, of course. All of our flights take a payment. But don't worry, for first-time flyers and for the heroes of Aetheria, I will give you a small discount on your tickets. How does that sound? I'll accept a physical payment of about 225 Ethereum coins. 225 Ethereum! And that price rose, bro. What's the problem, heroes? Is that a bit too much? Fleece chuckles with her same hateful expression, which Marshy is absolutely nailing right now. I I'm didn't... afraid there isn't much else I can offer, Euros. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't read the context, you little no, shit. I'm also not sorry. I can't believe you don't remember what this character was, who this character was. I cannot. I, I I'm afraid there isn't much else I can offer, Euros. <laughs> Noobs don't talk. <laughs> I'm afraid there isn't much else I can offer, Euros. If you cannot pay for your trip, I cannot take you to the provinces. All right, w look, whatever. All right, we'll just find another way. God damn. Well, looks like I'm finally starting to rub off on you guys. You know, why stimulate the economy and do things legal way just to steal? We're not going to steal a we ship. Don't... Okay, uh, we just don't have that much sunlight left. So heads just up. Just ride it for free. It's pretty easy. I mean, like, right, you can fly. And just stay close to the town hall so we can spread their data. And you, Yeah. we might have to leave you behind. Oh. <laughs> Come on, dipshit. Let's just get near the town hall and let's think. So, we so need far, a ship, and none of them are willing to take us for and free. Bank isn't open, so we can't convert money. Hey. What about. Oh, no, no, we're not. There's no way. What? Absolutely what? not. What? Lily's little best friends, or whatever the hell. Oh, it is. What have you got about sky pirates? You call themselves idealists. Yeah, sky pirates. And they're hippies. They're fun. And they're okay. hippies. Okay. They're more fun than all the 
stuck up people here. I don't need fun. I just need people to get me to a location so I can do my I job. I need fun. Yeah, something tells me you're doing a pretty good job stimulating it yourself. That's fair. I try. Thank you very much. Cat, I will trade yeah. your cat for this straw. It's not a magic straw. It's a fun straw, though. Kind of requires other people to be fun with. And nope. frankly, I don't think you guys are all that, you no, know, no, no. interesting. Look, look, see? It's a one-player game. I can do that with your hat. But straw's better. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> I tried. I tried. Are you trying to <laughs> rob from a ghost? Something tells me that's not exactly an easy thing to do. It is not. <laughs> <laughs> I just want my hat back, man. Oh, come on, let's get upstairs nope. before that it's a thing. Cat now. Hey, get him. Oh, yeah. Here comes the. Where did the seat go? The cat, you broke the seat. God damn it, cat! <laughs> cat is evil! <laughs> Alright, look, we'll just wait out the night, I guess. Oh, yeah. Yay! I get to bully you the entire time! <laughs> oh god. I can't go So, downstairs. party games. Party what what games. kind of party games? Do I have anything? Party games? Anyone have party games? We have past the straw. Wait, wait, I got an idea. Can I trade you a magical item for a magical item? Oh. Mm hmm? I got an idea. Oh. Hello. Guess not, we're busy talking to someone now. Bruh. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, uh, Rexy, take that. Thank you, thank you. Thank you! Thanks. Okay. Don't- she's trying to say it. Cat, don't take the key. <laughs> Alright. To so know. Mm-hmm. Now we just gotta wait out the night, though. Yeah, let me see if I can try this. Cat? Hi. I trade you this for the hat. It's an apple. What use do I have for an apple? Get out. What is this guy saying? He's <laughs> saying that we could probably head out soon. As soon as the sun comes back up anyway. That's not very interesting. After the last time we were outside, I didn't exactly fancy my chances with those idiots. This guy, speak to me. Rex. Yeah. yeah. Last night you meant you said a name. Who were you talking to? What? It was like Kira or something. I'm pretty sure I didn't. I heard what, like you. In my sleep I heard or you some say shit? it. No, it was uh. Oh yeah, you not did. Last night, you did but the point. night before when we were waiting out for the the things to come out. It was like Kira cut it or something like that. No, I definitely said nothing. Hmm. Huh. Maybe I was just. I only called that one by cat. Now. <sighs> Look, the sun's coming up. What about you, Yay! buddy? Do you have arrows? I do, but I, I do not. Can I have them? Please. Um, like mm. especially now, can I have those arrows? No. Is it safe to exit? Come on, I don't see anything. Okay. Rex, do you have arrows? No. Why not? I'm not an archer. Oh. Man, why did Lily leave? God. Whatever, I'll go find. Damn it. Go find Whatever. some arrows. Talk to these people like. <gasps> Oh, Did you just- You good? What a gnarly jump made by yours truly! What happened? Ow. Oh god. Yeah. Hello. Dreamer sits at the top of his ship, with his hands behind his head casually, humming a bit to himself as some of the workers shout at him and his crew. So it doesn't seem to heavily infect him. In fact, he'd be grinning. Oi, Dreamer! Or whatever you're called. He glances back at you all and smirks. If it ain't the heroes, here to visit again. To what do we owe this stupendous honor? 
Well, I remember you guys said you're always available for adventures, right? Adventures are middle name. What about it, huh? He sets himself up, his wings spreading to their full span as he leans over to observe you all. Some heroes feeling a little adventurous lately? Oh, scandalous. <laughs> oh, shut up! We need your ship. Oh, yeah? What for? Wait, no, wait, I wanna guess. Hero work, right? <laughs> you know, for people who came to my ship all that time ago preaching about how they aren't heroes, you seem to be attached with me performing daily heroics. What's up with that, huh? We, we want to help Etheria and Aelin give us a map. A map? Huh. A map to where? We have to find the Trials of Seal. What the hell? <laughs> he starts to chuggle, bringing a hand up to his temples and dragging it all the way down his face. Trials? As in plural? Come on. You're pulling my wing at this point. Listen. Aelin said there were trials all over the provinces. The server did not. Well, this is some damn news to me. <laughs> I knew that Aelin girl was off her rocker, but never this much. Listen up, you flightless moas. I don't know what you about your little group here, but me and my crew have been all over this realm, and we've never seen a trial of sea elves except for the one that's right in the, his city. What, you saying Aelin's lying? I'm not saying she's lying, but I will say I think she's crazy. I mean, you can't seriously believe her talk about myths or legends as fact. Not only that, but the last time I checked, no one can talk to God. And hell, if they could, then why doesn't everyone? Maybe Ciel only wants to talk to certain people. Well, that just seems unfair to me, doesn't it? We'll make some people better to talk to than others. And if it has to do with magic, then why do only those people, able to talk to the goddess, get to make choices on her behalf? He leans back again, his wings folding inward. You see what I mean? Look, I don't care about how unfair it is. I don't give a shit. I need a ride, so will you give us one or not? So that's what you really want, eh? Why don't you just start with that, instead of... You gotta go on some idiotic tangent about divine destiny or whatever. He scoffs. <laughs> Alright, I'll bite. I'll let you use my ship for some fun little trips through the Aether. Is that what you want? Uh, obviously. For a price, of course. Alright, you're fucking kidding me. <laughs> What's there to joke about? We're not running a charity service here, you know? <laughs> okay, how much do you want now? Eh... Uh, well, charging money's definitely one way to empty your pockets and run you dry. Let's just say that paying for a trip for me is far more expensive than a bit of a ethereum. If you want me to be your little ship chaperone, I'm going to need you to... ...return something to me. A rather valuable item that was, unfortunately, taken from my very grip. Uh, what are you talking about? Somewhere on the second floor of the bank, there is an item that I had to give away, unfortunately. A very, very valuable item. I don't care how you get it, but I need it returned to me. Do you understand? If you can do that, consider your trip paid for. Okay, well, fine. We'll get you your damn item. We're gonna roll okay. Crime okay. is cheaper than That's money. That's actually come in handy today, then. The ideal ship. The dreamer has asked that we get told? some... Dreamer has asked that we get his something for him from the bank if we want to get a ride through the provinces from him. That's all we're supposed to get for him. He didn't give us too many details. Either way, we have to do this somehow, or else we don't have a ship. Okay, well, let's try to figure out where this bank is before the sun goes down. All right, Gray's here now. Why is he evil? Indeed. Wait, what? Gray's here now. There's a kid? Okay. Yeah. Gray, I, I read that as gay. <laughs> Gray stares you all down carefully, glaring a bit as he jogs his foot. Um, howdy, Gray. What you talking to the pirates about, huh? We just needed a ship. That's it. Yeah, sure, you just needed a ship, huh? And I just need a couple more pairs of wings. You're trying to cause some trouble, aren't you? 
That's the only reason why people like you would willingly side with pirates. Aren't you supposed to be heroes? I'm not a hero. <laughs> yeah, well, neither am I. You can go on some cool adventure with Sky Pirates without me! Listen, you want to go on the adventures with us? Why? You think I can't because I'm a kid? That's not- no, 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 that's not what we said. Just you wait! I'm not a kid, you hear me? And I'm definitely not helpless. Ha! <laughs> I know for a fact I'm stronger than you heroes. You're nothing but losers in my eyes. Losers that think they're better than everyone else just because they just did something good or whatever. Good is boring, and so are you! I'm gonna make you regret looking down on me. Uh, oh no. Uh -oh. Yeah, I don't have time for this, Warp's antics. Oh no. Come on. Oh no. Hey, what about that market thing? That that, that seemed fun. The market. The the yeah, I guess we should yeah, probably check that. that out. Market. Yo, speak English, you stupid in, motherfucker. In interior market. Yes. Inside market. Inside market. Okay, I could not remember. Oh, you the know words. where you're going, bitch. <laughs> I mean, oh, it doesn't oh, have doors. Actually... Excellent. Oh, that's, that's what this place is. Oh, yeah. that. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Nice. I mean, what else yeah, would it be? It's a whole bunch of market stop stalls, lagging, you know. Lagging, stop lagging. Yeah. Hmm. There are people here. Yavin. Hello? Welcome to the Avalon Market Store! What can I get ya? What does he have to sell? Oh. Oh. Pickaxes oh. and ore? Gravitite. Gravitite. It's gravitite. I don't know, but it looks fun and shiny. I want it's it. expensive. It is Look expensive. I know. Some stuff I've never heard of. Um, hey, you're from Avalon, right? What can you tell us about it? Well, some of the best resources and materials come from our cities and towns in Avalon. We got some of the largest mines in all of the Ethereum provinces, and lots of these other provinces wouldn't have the same goods now if it weren't for us. We got the largest mining colonies too, and although we're not the biggest territory in the Ethereum provinces, we got the largest islands. Hmm. hmm. Good to know, I guess. Man, this was Who's a good Amy? Idea. Welcome to the Arcadian Market Stall. What can I get? What can I help you with today? What does she have? That is Klaus. Stars. Fallen star. Fallen star? What? She still sells clouds and stars. That's so. You said Arcadian, right? Tell me about Arcadia. Arcadia is the province that lies east of Etheria. Arcadia's province is said to have higher altitudes than the other provinces, and therefore it's a central province for the collection of cloudfish. What? Additionally, the province is known for a number of entertaining activities that are best enjoyed on vacations, making Arcadia the province with the top tourist percentages out of all the Ethereum provinces. Our top resorts are known for cloud swimming, relaxing wing massages, speed racing obstacle courses, whale riding, and a gorgeous aurora view at night. Oh my god, I want to go there. I go there, please. Can we go there? Please. Calm down. Uh, we have to go there. <laughs> We're gonna have to go there eventually. Damn. Don't don't trust cat around the whales. Awesome. Hello. Welcome to the Elysium Market Saw. Anything I can get you? What do you have? Well, those are some fancy machines. Uh, yo, they got <laughs> Hey, didn't someone say something about breakable machines? That sounds fun. I wanna break some machines. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Can you tell us about, um, Elysium? No. Apparently not. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> the problem with Elysium is in the center of- is the center of technological production within the Ethereum provinces. We're known for manufacturing a number of the technological parts that you can find here in Ethereum today. We're also known for the development of most Ethereum tools. Since our province lies on some of the most profitable metal resources and power sources, we produce and provide the rest of the Ethereum provinces with the materials necessary for bettering their society and advancing their technology. Ah. Hmm, that's interesting. East Haven of Ethereum or whatever. Oh, nighttime! Or something. Um, we're nighttime. inside. One. I think we're okay. We're indoors, Cam. Yeah. Chill the hell right. out. Sorry, I, I, I... Serenity? Welcome to Rapture Market Stall. What is it that you need? What do you sell? Huh. Capes and gloves and a life is... shard for Holy 128 shit. Ethereum oh coin. God. Holy shit! Okay. No idea what a life shard is, but cool. How do I? So, so uh, yeah. what can you tell us about Rapture? 
You see, Rapture is one of the larger provinces of Aetherian territory. Not only that, but Rapture is where a ton of the Valkyries themselves come from. <laughs> After all, you can't exactly get stronger in this place if you grow up in all, all privileged and protected, yeah? We've got a ton of programs and towns made for training Valkyries, and the largest number of pantheons in the entire region. For you tourists, if you're interested, we've got the largest pantheon in our province. It hasn't been used in quite a bit, but it's a huge monument with tours now available in between the hours Stop. of noon and sunset. <laughs> Nothing downstairs, come on. Yeah, we kind of have to chill in here, though. Unless we want to... Nope, guns out. out. Oh, nope, stay. Out, guns out. Cat. Cat. Did you block the door? Cat. <laughs> I, I did nothing. I'm, I'm, um, I'm carrying too many things. What are you talking about? Whatever. Do, you're not even gonna place it down? Okay, whatever. I don't know where it was, idiot! Okay, okay, you could've just put it on the, the rest floor. of the grave! <laughs> Alright. So now that we've solved that... Of I'm just course. gonna wipe my hands clean of what I just did. We should look around. Yeah. I can. I'll look at it. I'm not sure. We're gonna have to deal with the bank eventually. Let's just go. Oh yeah, Come we on. were gonna do crime. Let's go do that. No, don't say that. Okay. Rex already committed. Where's the bank? We're going to do crime. Oh. I get him. <sighs> Hello. There's Marshy. Jesus Christ. Come on. Hello. Welcome to the Ethereum Bank. Is there anything I can help you with? It had just slowed. <laughs> uh, well, rip, I guess. Oh, the guy. Look, we wanna. Oh. I wanna know how currency exchange works. Oh, it works. That's definitely a thing. Five platinum is. Five platinum two for two Ethereum. Okay, oh. good to know. Okay. I guess I could make some money now if I wanted to, but I'm not sure if I want to drain my Enderium like that. Damn. Yeah. Hey, how do you open an a like a bank account here? Start an account. Oh, all right then. Um, let me just gather the right paperwork and speak with Charmaine about it very quickly. You may wait upstairs for her. She'll be arriving in just a moment. You see? <laughs> it will be a pleasure to do business with you, heroes. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Upstairs, she okay. says. I'm gonna grab monies. Cause we'll yeah, I'm just it. getting some currency real quick just to be safe. I'll keep I don't an see eye anything, out. though. There's a book here. Update. Hold on, let me take it out because formatting is weird with it in the frickin' desk. Yeah, I'll keep an eye out. Those idealists once again decided to park without a permit. It seems they believe themselves to be above the law. This is truly the last straw. If you do not pay today, I will be calling the Valkyrie to remove them by force. Update. Surprisingly, it seems that Dreamer did not want the trouble. He paid with a rather valuable item. Suppose they may remain for now. Huh. So he paid with something and then just gave it up. We need to find an amulet. Where the hell is it, though? Is it downstairs? I thought he said it'd be upstairs. It said level two. This is definitely level two. Yeah, so it should be somewhere unless it's like fucking hidden. Unless there's like a secret attic I don't know about. Crime. We're just in an office. Unless it's still on them. It might be. Well, that would suck, huh? Uh, carpet? Nope. Yo, knock it off with the glove. Oh. There is There's a downstairs. The There's a downstairs? Yeah, with a locked door. Okay, so we break the door and we go in and we steal. I, I can't don't... break that lock, especially with someone right there. Yeah. No, wait. I have an idea. What's your idea? They have a key. Hmm? Cat, the thing you stole. Cam, 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 cam. Can I have my fishing rod back? Yeah. You took this from her? No, Cat had me hold it. Boop. Oh. Key. Excellent. <laughs> Come on. 
Oh shit. Hey, oh, pause shit. off anything that's not yours, okay? Uh huh. Yeah, exactly. We're just Cat. looking for Cat. And see a pendant. The thing down we here. need, okay? Good cat take And anything. I need lots of money. No, you no. don't. No. Cat, you can't even You're hold right. It. I don't need lots of money. Yeah, just steal it. What's oh, back here? More yeah, yeah, chest. you could just steal it's it. Probably you don't need money. Doesn't work. Well, we could have Cat go through the door, but she's not gonna be able to get it back through it. Well, it could be a key on the upstairs. inside. Could be. Cat, drop Why your stuff. They... Yeah, Cat, okay, okay. Are you gonna give it back? My gauntlet? No! But I'll give you back your stupid fishing rod. Okay. Your gauntlet was boring anyway. Go. Okay. Hey. Here. Thank you. Wow. Fancy engraved pendant. That's you a thing. can't carry it back to the wall. Is there a key to this door? Hold on. Where's there your we switch? Go. They lock the key inside the room? How would they get in there? Probably someone with another fucking key! Okay, I'm sorry. Yoink. Okay, let's get out of here before... Okay. I wanted to open an account. Oh, whatever. Another time. Come yeah. on. Yeah. Bye, have a nice day! Here, cat. What? This is yours. Yay! Just don't, don't use it with anyone can normal, I, yeah? Can I, can I have Come needed, on, actually? Let's just go get this pendant back so we can be done. Yeah, let's go get a ride. For there my go. benefit, of course. Go, town hall, now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, town hall. What? Oh. Go, 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 the chairs got destroyed. I can't use them to barricade the door anymore. Go. Does it need to be barricaded? We're fine. Do you want to see if the beds work? Not for you guys. Let's sleep. <laughs> well, it's daytime now. Come on. Here comes the <laughs> sun. Do 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 do. Hey Rex, <laughs> I have a key. Uh huh. It's a key. It, it was it was for the thing. I kind of don't want it anymore. Can you have it? Okay, thanks. Oh, well, yeah. Come on. And now the responsibility will be pinned on you. Let's just get moving. Where were we going again? Oh, yeah, we were giving this pendant back. Not sure why it's so important, but... You uh, never know? I don't know, it's fancy. Hello. Dreamer seems shocked when you hand him the amulet. He takes it into his hands carefully and sighs. <sighs> hmm. Dreamer looks at each of you as he slips the strange purple amulet around his neck, chuckling. Hello again, old friend. Hope you didn't have too much fun without me. Look, okay, we got your amulet, now let's just get go- Hang on! Mellow your moe's groundlings. We're not quite ready to set sail yet. In fact, I'm still not sure if I want to take you. But well, well, we just got you, you're goddamn- Getting me the amulet back was to ensure your trip was paid for. What I'm about to ask is to make sure this trip won't go poorly. He gets a more serious look as he sighs. Listen. This little journey we're going on. By the looks of your map, it's not particularly going to lead me nor my people in directions I completely approve of. And I don't know about you, but- as the captain of this damn ship, the safety of my crew is one of my top priorities. So, what are you getting at? What I want to make sure is whether or not I can trust you to not only hold your own and not endanger my ship. That you can fight your own ba- I did, yeah, I, I don't- I'm gonna reread that first line. I, I did, don't think I read it right. What I want to make sure is whether or not I can trust you to not only hold your own, but to not endanger my ship. That you can fight your own battles without running back to the ship with your feathers in a fritz and getting us all killed by some celestial. Listen, we've saved the Aether. I think we know how to fight. But do you know how to fight the creatures you can't even defeat? Um... If you want to get on the ship and take it to your little invisible god trials, 
Then I need to make sure you're, I know that you're strong enough to take care of yourselves. I need to know that I'm not about to put faith in a lost cause by helping you out there, alright? So here's what you're gonna do. I'm sure I don't have to explain the celestial creatures that have been attacking all over the place at night, right? Well, no, we got it. I mean, like, kind of firsthand, even. Good! I don't have to explain what I mean that I say that I want you to incapacitate one. Wait, you want us to do what? If you want to take this ship on some big adventure to completely lose some stupid divine destiny to talk to so damn god, then you're going out to incapacitate an enemy you can't defeat. If you can do that, it'll prove to me that you're not only capable, but you're intelligent and resourceful. Do that? And we'll set sail on the spot. Understood? Yeah, okay, alright, fine, whatever, understood. What? God damn, this guy's irritating. <sighs> How, what? How are we gonna incapacitate that fuck? I don't know, idiots, but it makes sense. Also, it would be good to know how to incapacitate him fuck? in the future. There we go. Oh, no. Just... We're gonna need a way to take these things on. We can't act like we are gonna be able to dodge them forever. Sing At some point, you might get backed into a corner. And I don't know about you guys, but I'm not sure if there's gonna be any negative effects from those, alright? Dying to voidal creatures kind of isn't fun. I'm not sure if that's similar in any way. Yeah, I have no idea either. Hmm. What if I killed you? Okay. It's noon. Sure, Does nothing would happen. Fun effect? Oh, okay. We gotta um, have the yeah, day. Yeah, probably piss me off. I have half the day that is a fun out. effect! Thanks, Rex! I didn't think of that one. Look, if anyone's gonna know what might be Elin. Yeah. How about we just get back to the chapel? Yeah. She might have some divine wisdom, and then we can just figure it out from there. <laughs>